Hi there, my name is Laura Polasek. I'm Practice Director for Digital at Bain. I'm based in the Milan office and I'm here today with James Anderson, a leader of Bain Digital. We are here to give you a quick overview of the digital work we do at Bain. But first, let me have James introduce himself. James, do you want to take it away? Hello, everybody. My name is James Anderson. I'm a partner in our London office and I work on a whole range of digital topics, but in particular advanced analytics and enterprise technology and across a wide range of industries. So retail mainly is my passion, but I also love financial services and tech and telecoms as well. Uh, to get started, why don't you share with the recruits watching us a little more about uh, the Bain approach to digital? and yeah, the type no, of work we do. I'd love to, I'd love to do that, Laura. And, it, and it's fascinating, isn't it? Because digital is no longer a kind of a standalone project or business unit. I'd say about 70% of the work that we do these days has got some element of digital within it. And the impact of digital has been pretty fundamental on all of our clients, all the way from uh, you know their fundamental strategies, their business models, how they connect with customers, how they make decisions internally using AI and automation, all the way through to how they manage their supply chains to be more optimized, more resilient and more sustainable. So it's, it's, it's a pretty holistic impact that's happened to our clients over the last decade or so. And as a result, I think our approach to digital has to be holistic as well. You know, we, we have to be able to connect strategy to technology delivery to people change and ultimately to results as well and that end-to-end -end perspective that we uh and focus on and focus on results i think is uh, special and different to, to what other people do i mean the, the other part that we've taken a very conscious decision on is to create a an integrated digital platform we call it we call it vector uh externally uh, and that allows us to connect all of the different elements of digital in a way that makes sense for our clients and enables them to deliver an end-to-end -end digital result, not just a kind of a point improvement on one, one aspect of digital. What are the reasons of leading companies choose Bain for digital work? Yeah, it's a good example. It's a, it's a good question, Laura, because there's actually there's a, a plethora of different uh, people who, who, who play in this market. And, and I would say, there are three things that are special about what Bain brings to uh, uh, delivering digital results for our clients. So the first one is just this recognition, as, as I mentioned before, that digital is everywhere. It's, it's not a silo. And so bringing a more integrated approach to our clients where we actually connect our digital delivery capabilities to strategy and results delivery, I think is really critical. And that's that also comes about in the way that we work internally. We have mixed teams of both generalist consultants and data scientists and digital prototypers working together in the same room, but also how we work with our client as well. So that level of collaboration and integration, I would say, is the first one. The second part, I think, is our deep technology capabilities. So we have over a thousand internal experts now in those different elements of vector. And these are people who've got advanced degrees in machine learning and AI, who've been ex-CIOs, who have built digital product for some of the world's leading digital companies. And that very deep capability and being able to deploy it at pace and at scale with our clients is, uh, is, is, is very valuable. And over the past um, five years or so, Laura, we've also made a number of significant acquisitions in that area to build out our capabilities so that we have uh, both scale and best of breed in all of those different areas. And then the last thing I think would, I would say is very differentiated about us is our curated ecosystem uh, of uh, uh, hundreds, probably almost thousands of um, different partners now that we work with. We fundamentally believe that the best innovations out there, some of them will come from Bain, but also there's a lot out there in the marketplace. So we have uh, a very active role in connecting to those startups through our VC connections and, and actually a lot of the ex-Bain entrepreneurs who are driving those businesses and connecting them with clients as well. 
and that allows us to deliver you know not only new levels of innovation to our clients but also significant scale through those ecosystem partners uh, to enable our clients transformations but but overall it all comes back to the kind of the you know the the fundamental bain truths which is that if you if you want to really drive results you have to connect both strategy to customer and operations through to people change and results delivery and having that end-to-end -end view with a with a real focus on results i think is what differentiates us to bring that a bit more to life do you have an example of real client uh, engagement where you support the client to develop a digital business Hey, I've, I've got lots, Laura. You know, a couple a couple of them that I've been working on recently that I'm really passionate about. I'd love I'd love to talk about. So, one of them is in grocery retail, which, as you can imagine, is going through you know a fundamental disruption at the moment. Not only given the impact of the discounters in many markets, but also the shift towards uh, online deliveries uh, and rapid delivery services. So it's a it's a fast moving fast moving field. And it's also fascinating because it's a, it's a business where thousands of decisions are made on hundreds of thousands of SKUs every week, right? So it's a, it's a business which is really calling out for the application of advanced analytics to improve decision making and to scale some of those best, uh, uh, some of that best talent. So we've been working with this particular client for I don't know the best part of nine nine months now, helping them to. Uh, connect all the data from their disparate systems into one central uh, data lake so that we can deploy analytics on it to help them to make better commercial decisions on their ranges in store, which you know provide better value to customers, more exciting ranges with more newness, but also face into topics like what's the you know carbon emission footprint of the of the ranges that we're deploying and how much plastics is used with our different suppliers. So that kind of full end-to-end -end thinking on the optimization. And it's another great example of how you can combine delivering advanced analytics, but also the last mile of connecting that with the commercial analysts and buyers in an organization to help augment their decision-making as opposed to replace them uh, and create the best of both human and machine to deliver a better outcome for the business and for customers. If you would like to learn more, we have a ton of information about our digital work uh, on our website, or feel free also to ask your recruiting team for more information. And thank you for joining us today.